Hey friends, welcome to Minimalese. I'm sorry, I am a huge mess today because I have already started painting our office slash workroom um, and I'm really excited about it. It needed a little bit of an update and so we had budgeted um, $100 for that room and now I think we're down to about like $80 for that room because we just did our bedroom update and it cost a little bit more. So, uh, it's fine. I think all I really need is I needed a new curtain and a plant and the paint. So we should definitely be able to come in around $80, which is awesome. So I'm gonna walk you through all the steps of us updating this room and I hope you enjoy it. Remember to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and my next video will come out next week. So I just started in, this is like our guest room slash we don't have a bed in here, so mostly the office. And I just started, we patched the walls up and I'm painting it the same color as my bedroom. And then I think I'm just gonna get some new curtains up um, that are a little bit nicer. And I might try and find like a plant or something to put in here. This beautiful new plant is the one that I'm gonna put in our bedroom when that's done. And so those two rooms will be nice and updated a little bit. Um, I am going like a light, light gray. Um, this room especially is very small, so I didn't want it to be too dark. And I liked the stripes, but it was just time for a little bit of an update. And so I'm gonna go with a lighter color this time because I found that when I have lighter colors, it's just easier for me to be in that room for long periods of time. And this might end up being like a workout room slash meditation room. So I want it to be really peaceful when, when I'm done.
right, friends, so that was it. We are done. I hope you enjoyed watching the process of that very simple update of our office workroom area. And all we really changed was the paint color and we changed the curtains. And so it was relatively cheap. I'm still looking for a plant, but I think right now I'm just gonna take a plant from downstairs that needs to be repotted anyway. So maybe I just get a new pot, which I have one in mind and it's like $8, so that shouldn't be too expensive. The paint was 36 uh, and this is the same color as my bedroom. So it's called, she's, she, I have such a hard time with that word. It's called uh, seashell gray. It's at Lowe's if you like the color. It is super light gray, but I wanted something that was a little more warm than just a plain white. And so I really feel like it fit the bill perfectly. Um, I think eventually I'm gonna add some artwork or some more plants, but I think it's definitely a good idea to start slow and start with the things that you really want to change. Like we really wanted to change the curtains and the, the paint and the paint color. And I think both of those things really lifted the room, made it look a lot more friendly and inviting. And I'm very excited to be able to get started working in there. So if you've enjoyed this video, remember to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next week.